Okay, I think I'm recording. Right, I've come down to my little science laboratory at home. Um, I've written red, blue and green on the, on the paper. And I've got a green filter that lets green light through if I hold that over the camera. I'm hoping, yep, everything looks green. Um, and blue and red. It, this, this works really well with the red, I think. And I can just, I don't, I don't even need to hold it over the camera. If, if I just take this piece of red and I put it over the green and move it over the black and move it over the red, red almost disappears, doesn't it? I can, I can just about make it out a bit. But, and blue and green there, it'd be hard to know which one is blue and which one is green from this camera view. Yeah, um, even when I look with my high resolution eyes from here, I wouldn't know which is which. And I can kind of bring in some, I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring in a blue and green pen. Now I'm gonna make, make it go red first. Right, so there's my blue and green pen. Focus on it. I'm just gonna focus, struggle a bit. Anyway, which one's blue and which one's green? Is blue on the left or is green on the left? Um, well, let's have a look, if I take away the red filter, you can see, yes, it was blue on the left and green on the right. So when I put this red, I just got a bigger piece of it actually. Put on my red filter. So only um, um, red light can get through and therefore blue and green look black now because there is no light coming from there. Blue only gives off blue light, so it's reflecting blue light, so the, the light's coming from above. It's going through the transparent film, it's hitting the paper. The paper is white, therefore that can reflect all the colours, so it's reflecting red, so the, the white paper is now red. Okay, um, but the red is also, um, can reflect red light. But, but, but there's therefore no difference between the paper and the ink, hence we can barely see the word red. And blue and green, they reflect um, um, blue light and green light respectively. They don't reflect red. And therefore by putting a red filter on, then the, the, the blue light and the green light can't escape. As soon as I remove the filter, then the blue light is now being reflected and the green light is also being reflected. Do it that way as well, so you can see the difference. Yeah, hopefully you can see there that yeah, the green and the, the blue look very, very similar and the red's almost disappeared. Doesn't work that well with the other with the blue film. Um, again, you can you can still kind of make out. I mean it has made the red look very black on that one, but I can still see the blue um, and the um, Green, so yeah, the the hue, the the kind of blue doesn't quite match my filter, whereas the red ink and my red filter match almost completely, and therefore the uh, the word red gets completely, well, almost completely obliterated, um, where well, you can't distinguish it from the light being reflected from the the white as well. So that's just me doing it um, in my little homemade laboratory.